WooCommerce login and registration plugin for beginners. Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I'll show you guys a quick tutorial on how you can add and get started with a plugin that will enable you to create a login and registration page on your WordPress WooCommerce site. So let's get into it. Now it's very simple and very easy. So we're going to break it down step by step. First, I'm going to show you guys which plugin you should download. Then we're going to go into the setup of that plugin. And then we're just going to activate it on our actual WordPress site. So to get started, all you have to do is click on plugins on the bottom left and then click on add new plugin. Once you click on add new plugin over here, you're just going to search for ultimate member. So ultimate member is a plugin that enables you to create registration page login page special restricted user areas there are multiple different plugins for this you can search for membership like this and you will get multiple different options available however i've tried out a bunch of different plugins ultimate member usually works the best however there are some other tools that are just as great such as the content memberships pro and other tools so we're going to use ultimate member and i'm just going to click on install over here and once i click on install i'm going to click on activate and now we are going to activate our plugin so once we click on activate over here this is going to open up the installed plugin section and now our plugin has been activated so once your plugin has been activated you will see on your left panel you have ultimate member showing up so you want to click on ultimate member over here and once you click on ultimate member you can get started with managing and creating your registration and login pages so to get started you're going to click on forms on the left and you can click on settings later on as well because you guys can see where you want to add a certain page so if i want to you know add a page on let's say i want to add a login page and i want this to be at my account or you know wherever you might want it to be so you can set all of that later up with your pages section because as you guys can see currently these are our pages and this is like our sample page that we've created as well so i'm going to go back into ultimate member and i'm going to build our registration form and login form first so if you click on forms on ultimate member you will see there are a, a couple of different forms that are built such as your default registration default login and default profile now you can always create a new one however one thing i find to be super easy is just clicking on edit on your default registration page and you will see the registration form so it has the username first name last name email address and password uh, we can change the layout like this as well or we can keep a standard you know longitudinal layout then below that you can click on add field and you can add a larger field so let's say you also want to maybe collect some other information so let's say i want to collect their phone number so what i'm going to do is i'm going to add a telephone box like this and the title will be phone number and this will be for everyone and i'm just going to click on add over here meta key like this so over here it's going to add their phone number where people are going to you know enter their phone numbers you can always click on edit row and you can edit the entire row setting such as the appearance so if i want a certain hue i can select that over here as well i'm going to go with a pink a nude pink hue and then the text color i'm going to keep as black you can add a style as well and then the border color which is clear for us but i'm going to add a dark pink over here as well so we're going to use this and then we're going to just go into like the darker colors and then just click on update over here once you do that you guys can see this is the default form now I can add more information that I might want. So I'll click on add field and add more information, but I think this is uh, pretty much good. I don't need to add any more information. Let's say I don't need a username, so I can remove that. Let's say I use the first name and last name as usernames. You can do that as well, but I'm gonna keep the username for our personal website. Now, once I do that, I'm gonna click on update on the right panel over here. 
and once i click on update default registration has been updated now what i'm going to do is i'm going to click on settings on ultimate member in my left panel now we have our registration page which is on our sample page now your sample page is supposed to be your home page for us i haven't built a home page so i'm just using this sample page as our current home page then you have your access so in your access you're going to have your site accessibility any restricted content as well as the different types of content restrictions that you can put in could be for media product as well and other things now after that we have the appearance of our entire template so you can edit the overall appearance of your registration as well as some other settings now we're going to go into pages on the left panel and then we're going to open up our sample page we're going to click on view over here and this is our sample page it's just like an empty page and i can click on edit page over here to begin editing and customizing this page so as you guys can see this is just a simple page and on the right it has multiple different blocks you have your page and on the top left you can click on create and you will see different blocks that you can add you have media options as well you have your spacers stack calendar and more and then if you keep scrolling you can even embed your form that you just created with ultimate member you also have forms over here so from here we can just insert our form and we just have a simple form it's going to be a contact form so name email and message this is a simple form this is not the ultimate member form uh, we are going to be using the ultimate number one because that enables us to build a registration form which is going to build exclusive areas for our users where they can actually you know get started with their own types of uh, content they might have you know exclusive access so you can insert that and embed that as well now other than that in this particular page you guys will see on the top right you have your jetpack which is basically an assistant to help you build and then once you have updated your page we're going to go back into our pages under den and what i'm going to do is i'm going to just open up our store over here and this is our current pantheon or wordpress site now i'm going to change this up a little and i'm going to click on over here and we are going to be using the shop page or maybe We'll just do a quick view of this one as well yeah we're going to be using the dashboard page as our initial page so i'm going to go into ultimate member and then we are going to go into settings and then we can enable our registration page to be on our dashboard page click on save settings now it's going to appear on this particular page as well and you guys can see you have a my account section and then people can go on ahead and register as well so I hope you guys found this video helpful and you are now able to integrate a login and registration page for WooCommerce on WordPress. It's very simple and pretty easy. And if you found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And I will catch you guys in the next video.